I call it the secret that's been hiding in plain sight. And that is that connection between our nighttime dreams and writing. If you're a writer, you might already know this intuitively, even if you haven't given words to it. Maybe you write first thing in the morning or you write at night when you should be getting into bed, but you stay up just a little longer to jot down that poem or to work on that paragraph. That's because there really is a connection, scientifically speaking, psychologically, and even spiritually between the dreaming mind and the creativity that goes into writing, whether you're a journal keeper, a poet, a published author, or all of the above. So I want to invite you to write down your dreams this week and see what creative elements you can find in them. Just notice. That's a good first step. Also, I have books and classes that connect dreams and writing. In particular, my book, Dreaming on the Page, is coming out soon. And I'm offering Dreaming on the Page circles, where a small community of us can come together on Zoom and write and dream together. So come look at my links, look at my bio, join us and see what happens when you pick up your pen and dream. I look forward to dreaming and writing with you.